This is the Samsung Viewfinity S6 monitor, and it might just be the single device that replaces everything on your desk. For years, I've been juggling my work in tech sales, video editing for my YouTube channel, and personal stuff across multiple devices. And I was crying out for a central hub to replace the tangle of accessories that came with my device lifestyle. That changed three months ago when I started using this 34 inch ultra wide monitor, which I think might just be the ultimate productivity tool. So let's dive in and see if it really lives up to the hype. Thank you to Samsung for sending me this monitor to review, but this is not a sponsored video and all thoughts are my own. Let's go. Okay, this is an impressive piece of kit. 34 inches of ultra wide curved display real estate, check. PC docking with power and data and KVM switch, built in. Integrated webcam and speakers, also in there. It's like Samsung targeted every productivity pain point with the Viewfinity S6. Cable clutter, multiple devices and desk space, all through a single cable. I personally bounce between my work laptop, which is a Windows machine, and a MacBook Pro for personal use and video editing, both loaded with apps and tabs fighting for my attention. My old setup was a cluttered mix of a 23 inch AOC monitor, a laptop screen, travel monitor, and a separate dock with constant cable swapping just to switch devices. And after three months with the Samsung Viewfinity S6, which is my first curved ultra wide monitor, it's clear that this is the main peripheral device that I need on my desk. The expanded screen real estate has completely transformed how I multitask. And I now realize just how much I was missing out on for all those years. What's really been a game changer for my productivity, both in my tech sales and content creation, is its all-in-one hub functionality. Effectively a built-in USB-C dock delivering data and 90 watt charging, ethernet, webcam, speakers, and one standout feature, a KVM switch that lets you control two devices with a single keyboard and mouse. It's actually proved to be a really cool feature of this monitor. Oh yeah. Setting up this monitor is pretty straightforward, no tools needed, everything clicks into place and cable management is clean and simple. I had mine up and running without any drama in about 10 minutes. Port wise, you've got your one HDMI 2.0 port, your display port, two USB 3.0 slots and a single USB type C slot for power and data. Yes, I do wish there was more than one of those, but I have managed to make it work with just the one. Once it's set up, the build quality feels solid and premium. I was relieved that it didn't have the wobble some other monitors I've tried have on there. You've got a fully adjustable stand. It tilts, swivels, adjusts in height. Personally, I wish it would rise that little bit more to accommodate my open laptop. It's worth noting that this only occurs when I'm using my work Dell Latitude 16 inch laptop, which is larger than average. Whereas when I'm using my Apple Mac 14 inch, this monitor does go just about high enough to accommodate it, but we're only talking small margins. As for display quality, the S6 Ultra Wide has stunning colors and resolution from its HDR10 and Wide Quad HD. It's sharp, immersive, and the 1000R curve does make multitasking feel totally natural. Using the full widescreen for videos is an absolute dream. Gamers, I'm sure there's a few of you watching, and high power application users will love that it's got AMD 3Sync, which eliminates screen tearing and stuttering, reduces input latency, which basically means it makes gameplay feel much more responsive. I'm not personally a gamer, but because I'm so committed to you guys watching the review, I downloaded onto my iMac and had a go playing Combat Master. And for what it's worth, was very happy with the response responsiveness and I actually got quite addicted to the game as well but that's a separate subject. Now here's where the monitor really shines. Productivity. I use a Windows laptop for my day job in IT sales and a MacBook Pro for editing YouTube videos and for doing personal stuff, which apparently now includes gaming. My old dual monitor setup meant being restricted by a physical separation between screens, but now I have a crazy amount of options for where to place my different windows, and it could be my emails, CRM and browser side by side, or having the full screen for video editing on my Mac with a super wide timeline, which makes the whole process so much easier. But where the Samsung Viewfinity S6 really stands out in this area versus some of its close alternative models is the feature which I'm going to call multi-device 
multitasking. I've just invented that term. And what I'm actually referring to is the smart features PIP, which is picture in picture, and PBP, picture by picture, which is where I can keep two systems running side by side, all on the same screen, and stay focused without ever needing to switch devices manually. And this is all made possible thanks to the inbuilt KVM switch. KVM standing for keyboard, video, mouse, using the really easy to use joystick control underneath the Samsung monitor. No extra dongles, no awkward switching like I used to have to do. It's just really smooth and efficient multitasking. And as part of my setup, I use a Contour Unimouse and Balance keyboard, which I absolutely love because they're built for both Mac and PC layouts. Both my Contour mouse and keyboard buttons are formatted for both Mac and PC and can be remapped really easily and it's just really comfortable to use, which just complements my experience when I'm switching between the PC and the Mac. There's also a LAN port so I can plug in and give my laptop ethernet access, even if it doesn't have a port itself. All of this in one clean, minimalist setup. And for the multi-laptop setup I was just describing, you can get away with the USB-C for one of the laptops and an HDMI plus the USB-A cables for the second one. As for the webcam, the built-in five megapixels pop-up webcam is great for video calls and supports Windows Hello for secure logins. That's really useful for those logging into their work devices on Windows. There's also a ton of display modes, iSaver, game mode, and even auto source switch plus, which detects your devices automatically. And that's worked fine for me so far. And so to finish off in this review, the Samsung Viewfinity S6 monitor is a lot more than just a monitor. I found it to be a whole workspace in one clean, powerful package. It's surprisingly at a similar price point to the less premium brands equivalent models. For a cost of £440 or $660, this monitor really has helped me simplify my desk, separate work and personal life, and actually get more done. Yeah, I'm not going back to that old clunky, messy setup of mine. If you're looking to invest in something to streamline your workflow, ditch the dual monitor setup, or just want a more intelligent workspace, this is the monitor to beat. Thank you for watching. Please drop a like and subscribe and let me know your thoughts in the comments and I'll see you later.